Hello and welcome to the CNBC TV 18 special. We're coming to you from the World Economic Forum in Davos. Joining me now, a very special set of guests, Vinita Jain, the founder of one of India's oldest homegrown D2C brands, Biotech. Vinita, thanks very much for Thank joining you. us. Thanks. Yours is a fascinating story because you came from a Marwadi background where uh, women were not encouraged to work and certainly not encouraged to start their own businesses or start their own uh, ventures. What gave you the courage? What gave you the the audacity to start them. It was a passion. It is a passion. I grew up in the Himalayan mountains in my grandfather's tea plantations where I studied the ancient sciences of Ayurveda, yoga and meditation and I learned original Sanskrit. I combined it with 21st century biotechnology. So I combined the best of the East and the West and to preserve health and beauty for a lifetime because Ayurveda is the only science in the world who has found the elixir of beauty. Let's talk about the journey from here on because you've been able to build this company, you've scaled it up uh, a possible IPO is something that you're considering yeah. as well yeah, yeah. so is that is that the next target that you've mm. set for yourself yes we, biotech is planning its own IPO in uh, 2025 uh, biotech is a zero debt privately held company and uh, you know and unlike other companies which are just going for funding and uh, uh, we have we have grown uh, with 30% uh, year on year, so we've had extraordinary growth over the last 20 years and a double digit bottom line. So our IPO will be very interesting and we are looking at 2025 to go IPO. Well, while you were setting up Biotic, which were the role models that you looked up to? Mm -hmm. I mean, you know, everyone here is talking about the lack of role models. Who were you looking up to to say, this is who I, I, I would like to model myself on? No, I actually wanted to preserve health and beauty for a lifetime. That was my passion and uh, by, uh, Ayurveda is the elixir of youth. So I wanted to be beautiful and young. <laughs> Forever. <laughs> I started the company honestly and then every, I saw that lots of other want, people wanted to be beautiful and young forever so that's the genesis of the company it was not perfectly business but it was a passion to preserve and health and beauty for a lifetime which is becoming the buzzword today so Ayurveda actually pres uh, has understood uh, how to preserve uh, it's the elixir of youth. Mm. Uh, so you, you truly converted your passion <laughs> and your wish list into a very business. very viable, very profitable, very profitable and yeah. successful business. Yeah. Absolutely. 